Hi guys, in the first two videos of this series, we have explained how to make the intro and match cut effect show in a cinematic summer vlog. If you haven't watched that yet, go check out the link in the upper right to watch your videos. And today we will focus on the transitions presets used in the vlog, which I think would be of great use to your video creation. Without further ado, let's get started. In Video Pro Vlogger, find the Transitions icon at the top left. Click on it to open the panel, where you can find a bunch of transition presets that you can use directly. Choose the right one based on your image. For example, if you are switching between these two images, I would recommend you to use the lateral fade transition. Drag it directly to the middle of the two things, and then use a mouse to adjust the duration. The effect is finished. And then for these two images, I wanted to make the transition more lively. So I dragged in a dreamy transition. Once it's adjusted, we go ahead and add a ripple transition to these two frames. But in the preview here, we can find some stuttering. Well, that's fine. We'll adjust the transition type in the inspector. Select the stretch frame to get a lateral effect. And usually, at the end of the movie, we can add a fade to black transition to create a slow closing effect. On top of the dozens of transitions that come with VidiPro Vlogger, you can also find some light effect on material website. Import them into the software. Then, I want to do the transition design between the two images. Drag the cool light effect to the overlay track 5. Resize it in the preview window to cover the whole screen. And then adjust the duration. Find a blend mode in the inspector. Select a screen blend mode. Now you can create a blending of the full screen. And for the other warm tone light effect, I will add it to the middle of the two images that come with the sunset. Add it in the same way. The final effect will come out like this. If the effect is a little bit stiff, then you can also select it. Find a fade and move in the inspector. Add a fading and fade out effects. Let's see the result. If you're not satisfied with the basic transitions, then you can also combine multiple effects to create such an advanced transition look. Click on the video first. Go to the Motion Editor panel. Add a zooming preset to it at the right time. Click on the second keyframe. Adjust the range of the zooming effect. Move this keyframe forward a little bit. Don't forget to adjust its speed. Also, click at a keyframe in the last frame to maintain the zooming effect. Click Apply to apply the adjustment. Then, let's listen to the music here. 
and it can find a very strong drum beat. Thus, we use the image shaking effect to match music. Open the effect panel in the upper right left corner. Here we have a quick effect that can be applied directly. We drag it to the effect track. Then, use the mouse to adjust the duration of the effect track to match music. In addition, we will add a transition for the switch between this screen and the next one. Here, I choose the color distance transition, which will add more design sense to the video. Drag it to the timeline. Adjust the time duration. And this completes the design of a multi-effect compilation in your video. Well, stay tuned for the last episode of this series, which is a song design tips. And anyway, don't forget to click that subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye-bye.